Due to a temporary life change, I'm currently living at my mum's place. From the front, this looks no different to any other suburban house, but head through to the backyard and it's clearly a different story. Now the world thinks that all Australians are born surfers. This is Culborough Beach on the south coast of New South Wales and it is here that I plan to test this theory. I've set myself a goal to catch a wave every day for the next month and I haven't surfed in years. I'm more of a skateboarder. I don't even own a surfboard but I did find this foamy in the garage so come with me as I find myself a wave a day. Good morning. It's Tuesday the 13th of February 2018. This is wave number 13 of my Wave A Day project and it's a miserable, cold, raining, wet morning. The rules are I will take a wave every day no matter what the conditions are like. Damn it! I'm just a little too slow. There's dolphins right there. God, too slow, they're gonna go past. Isn't that cool? Those dolphins were right where I'm gonna catch my wave. They've gone that way now, unfortunately. They might come back, we'll see. Let's get in the water. I'm gonna run to the water, because that's what surfers do. I'm there. Wow, I got out here without even duck diving. My hair's still dry. That's awesome. Could I get a wave straight away? Considering that happened so fast, I don't think it counts. I've only been in the water for four minutes. I'm going again. I've also realized that I've got to be further up my board when I'm paddling for the wave. You don't want to be up the front so you nose dive, but you also want to be balanced flat on the water, I think. If you're a surfer and you're watching this and you're thinking this guy's got it all wrong, let me know. Okay, okay. Okay, here's one for me. So the thing with that wave was, yeah, I got up on it, but then I looked around and it was just a, just a bang. No, no wave to ride. Look at this. Wow, that really sucked. That was a nice wave, and my elbow let me down. I couldn't put the pressure on it to lift. Oh, that sucked. So just to recap what happened then, I went to get up and my elbow didn't collapse. It just didn't give me the power I needed. And I realized I was on this perfect position on a wave. I just couldn't get myself up. Pretty disappointing. I'm not working off the strength here. I got no strength. It sucks. That's the first time this elbow has let me down. Aside from the day that I did it, of course. That was a big letdown. Oh, what's this? Onto the sand! Well, I really wanted to pump that wave and ride it. It had no form and basically it was a longish ride but it just had no form and I just wanted to pump it and see how far I could take it. Well, it took me all the way to the sand and then dumped me right onto the sand. Didn't feel fun. Today was a good surf but not as good as yesterday. Come with me tomorrow on Wave A Day Part 14 when who knows what could happen. Sand dumps, long waves, dolphins, sore toes, who knows? Hey, thanks very much for checking out my Wave A Day mission. If you're new here to my channel, do me a solid and subscribe. And if you want to see my latest non-surfing related vlog, check here. Check out a completely random vlog here. And if you're feeling totally generous and you want to support me on Patreon, here. What's that, man? Ah, oh, the waves are better at that end of the beach. Ah.